what is going on guys it's your boy lucky charlie here with the final video for um the amenities should be a total of eight so this is the last one this is going to be the big one guys this is the one everybody needs no matter what uh this is how to get the r d station without buying without using marketplace cash all right, so if you take that vine out of there that I added to it, that is your R&D station. It's a little mini size one uh, that is smaller than the one in the uh, in the watchtower. All right, so let's uh, let me post up over here by my Superman, uh, Batman vs Superman posters. All right, guys, these are going to be in Arkham. Um, this is going you if you like I said if you do not have the money, you're not legendary. You got to go find this on your own. I feel your pain. So you would find these in Arkham Asylum. Like I said, plan on being there for a while because they do not pop up a whole lot. So if you like I said, if you're legendary, you might have to spend three or four hours a day out there until you get them all. Because I promise you it's very boring, which there is a lot of XOs. Unfortunately, they don't sell that good anymore. But there are other collections to go with it too. So there are other base items. They're just not amenity base items. I think one's like an electric chair or something. Or no, it's a barber chair. Um, some of the little um, knick-knack little uh, stuff. But like I said, uh, but none of it's amenities. Like the barber chair, you cannot get your haircut there. I promise you that. It's just an old-fashioned looking barber chair. So if you want to change your hairstyle, you still got to go to the watchtower. All right, guys. So this is out of the Arkham Personal Collection. So this is going to be... Whoops. In collections we're going to Gotham we're going down to the Arkham personal collections and I will go ahead and tell you that there are two very expensive ones here <clears throat> all right so like I said this is for the R&D station um, the first one is Killer Croc's tooth that one should be pretty reasonable I want to say most of these I, that I see nowadays are about 25 to 25 no more than 50,000 on most of these common ones uh, You might every once in a while find one for 150 or something like that And if it is it's probably mine because I, I, I try to make as much money as I possibly can because I'm greedy So you know if you see a 150 on there Hit your boy up. I don't care if the wood uh, below it's at 50 go ahead by the 150 bro Help your boy lucky Charlie. Out. I'm just playing you you do what you do All right, number two is penguins monocles Penguin's monocle, that little eyepiece that he holds on to and squints real hard to hold, hold together. All right. The number three is Clayface's Molding Clay. Clayface's Molding Clay. All right, here's a big one. Last time I did get this, somebody actually sent it to me. They were popping scanners and sent it to me, and it was probably a month ago. I got two mil for it. It was not one listed. The dude needed it for the R&D station. He paid me two mil. I'm not saying you'll get two mil out of it. I might have just got lucky. But I do know you can, you can get... I think I, I think I see this... Uh, usually I never see it under 600,000. Uh, 600,000 to two mil is my guesstimation on that. Unless you just got... I mean, but it, right now it could be cheaper because there's a ton of people out there trying to break their necks on these uh on these other collections they may not know how how rare this is unless they're watching this video because you know i try to make y'all money too after i make my money now i'm playing i try to make us all money you know I'm, I'm trying to make sure we we all have skill points we all got fat wallets and all the women want to talk to us they probably don't want to do nothing they just want to say oh go away but they still talking to us all right victor zaz's shirt Sorry, I'm in one of those moods. Sorry, guys. Victor Zaz's shirt. All right. The number 245 is Scarecrow's hat. Scarecrow's hat is what we're looking for. All right. Number two. Or, I'm sorry. I want to say how am I talking about. This is number six. Uh, two faces face uh, two faces face cream. Don't say that fast two, uh, three times fast. I promise you will mess up Two faces face cream. Don't try to do two face try to do face cream 
I would do. I would just do face C. I'm sure that will come up perfect. All right, number seven is Mad Hatter's bow tie. Mad Hatter's bow tie. Number eight is Aaron Cash's wrist watch. Aaron Cash's wrist watch. All right, now we're on the last two at the bottom, ladies and gentlemen. This is another expensive one. The I know I'm gonna I know what this word is. It's a little fucking dummy. The um that the ventriloquist <laughs> the ventriloquist wood polish. The dude that talk, uh, you know what I'm talking about. It's got the little puppet. Ventriloquist wood polish. All right. The last one is Batman's grappling, a grapple hook. Not grappling, grapple hook. Batman's with a S, possibly S. Grapple hook. All right, guys. Like I said, that is all of them. Hopefully, I didn't go too fast. If if not, you can always go back and relook at it and pause it by each one. Um, but basically, what you're getting is this little mini R and D station here that uh, that you can get for collections. I know a lot of you do not know this because y'all got on before. What was it home turf? Home turf is when all this stuff came out. All this stuff came out in home turf. So if you were home turf was already out, that's the reason why you don't know about it because they were not in the marketplace back then. If you seen somebody with it, and you're like, "How did you get that?" Oh, I found it over here. So basically, you're getting an R and D station. All right, guys, that's all eight videos. Please, um, hopefully, um, no, please, just hopefully it'll help you guys get whatever you need. Hopefully, you have most of this stuff. That way, uh. That way, you know, you're over here laughing at me like, I can't believe you're doing this old stuff. But remember, this channel is about uplifting and bringing good players back to D.C. You know, I I, I promise you, uh, there I, I've talked to a lot of my subs, a lot of people. And, like, the stuff I'm doing and everything, it, they're telling me it feels like old times. Like, when I do the live streams and everything else, they're like, God, it feels like... The, back in the good old days, back whenever you could run stuff with people and everybody was in the chat and everything else. And everybody stays in their league chats. Most people don't have mics anymore and stuff like that. So hopefully this stuff is helping you guys. I hope it is like crazy. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like to let me know this is helping you. Or if you want me to do more videos like this. Also guys, if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. I promise you my videos are like Lay's potato chips. You can't just eat one. I promise you. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Y'all have a great day.